Hi everybody, thank you so much for joining us. We're having so much fun talking about denim. And today I wanna compare two best 25 ounce Savage denim jeans from two giants, Iron Heart and Samurai. Thanks so much for joining everyone. Iron Heart and Samurai they are synonymous with heavyweight denim. You know, I talked in the last video how samurai in, in, in their roots, they were instrumental in bringing to market and popularizing 25 ounce denim. Ironheart on the other hand, in their roots, you know, they, they, they're motorcycle riders, they're bikers. You know, in their roots, denim is very practical armor for riding a motorcycle. So we'll jump right into it. So first of all, let's talk about Samurai. So Samurai uses 25 ounce unsamurized and unwashed denim. Whereas um, Ironheart uses 25 ounce sulfurized unwashed. So um, you gotta be a little more mindful of Samurai than being unsamurized. There is uh, a possibility of greater shrinkage. Whereas in Iron Heart, you know, because it's sulfurized, you know, the shrinkage is gonna be there, but it's gonna be limited. So um, in Iron Heart, when I buy Iron Heart, I essentially, you know, I'm size 32, 31. You know, I look at uh, measurement 32 across waist. You know, um, I, that's my ultimate measurement. So I just buy 32. I soak it, it shrinks to about 31 and a half, and then you wear it and it shrink, uh, and it stretches back to 32, 32 and a half. With, with uh, Samurais, uh, I go for size 32, and typically speaking, size 32 is roughly, starts out 33 and a half. Then you wash it <laughs> and it shrinks. It shrinks much more. It shrinks to about 31 and a half. Then you wear it and it stretches to 32, roughly and a half. So hopefully this is the, 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 the denim difference. Now, the other biggest, biggest, biggest difference in the construction is what uh, stitching they used. The Samurai uses all natural cotton stitching in my um, research, whereas Ironheart uses poly cotton blend for the stitching. So as you can see, man, I wore this hard, both of these pairs, okay? When you look at the back pocket, nothing is coming loose. When you look at the, uh, the coin, coin pocket, just tiny bit of stitching, but really, it's still strong, no holes. You know, the whole construction is very, very strong. When you compare this to Samurai, nothing is loose here, nothing is loose here. When you look at the back pocket, all intact. So even though they use different cotton uh, blends and cotton, uh, thread for, for their stitching. Both pairs incredibly strong. Both pairs held up incredibly well. So definitely, you know, uh, both of them uh, performed identical there. Although I see that um, I'm missing more stitches on my iron hearts than, um, than Samurai. The other big difference I noticed between sam Samurai and, and an Iron Heart is a tendency for blowout. You know, when you look at my Samurais, there is no start of blowout. When I look at uh, my, um, my Iron Hearts, there is a start of blowout. You know, Samurai and Iron Heart, they're synonymous with fading. In fact, the top pro level faders. They, they undoubtedly at some point will either fade a pair of Samurais or fade a pair of Iron Hearts. So in my hand, I'm holding 25 ounce in my left hand, Samurai Denim Special Edition jeans. 
in my right hand I'm holding 25 ounce triple seven extra heavy salvage denim by iron heart both of these pairs of denim are amazing in fact this pair of denim uh, the same model not the same jeans the same model uh, was crowned number one winner of you know the, the probably the most um, successful denim fitting competition indigo invitational in year two uh, this pair of jeans I personally faded in year three Indigo Invitational and placed top 51 out of 1200 competitors which is I think pretty amazing now let's talk about fading you know we were saying that uh, summer has a, a looser um, weave of the denim so it's not as tight and it produces a different fades I don't know if you can see it in the video the fades it produces are incredible there's a three-dimensional texture because you know the denim itself is more irregular because it's elusive with denim and the fading is just stunning absolutely stunning I mean look at the honeycombs behind the knees is just brilliant you know they do tend to fade faster than iron heart but you know that doesn't mean whole lot you still have to wear it you still have to put time in you still have to put effort into it but the rewards are just so beautiful and satisfying you know with iron hearts being a tighter weave you can see it's not giving up indigo easily in fact i believe iron heart sets the indigo and that's the reason why they don't fade as fast but when they do fade they create striking contrast you can see between the knees and you can see on the lower leg it's just the difference is striking you've got a dark indigo you've got a, a fade right here and the contrast is really really striking behind the knees you can see man I still have my work to do I mean I've got nine months ten months on this combined fading remember I couldn't do it through the summer it's just too hot and um, I would say I am right in the sweet spot where, where I'm gonna start seeing just really rapid fading of uh, denim that you know iron heart does that you know you push through you go for it and the most of your fading actually happens in in the last quarter uh, a fading process another big difference it's the tightness of weave so iron hearts have a tight weave denim versus of course samurai and we're gonna look at that has a, a looser weave denim and that translates into a different wearing experience and ultimately it will translate into different fading as well and we're gonna look at that as well so iron heart being tighter in weave tends to be warmer denim so you know spring say May it gets really hot I'm wearing triple seven quite a quite a um, narrow cut and it gets so hot that uh, with iron heart you know I can't push through it's just too hot now with Samurais, with Samurais, I wore them all summer. I mean, this is a, a little bit looser uh, cut. This is 710 versus triple seven in Iron Hearts. And with this cut and with this denim, I was able to wear it all through the summer, last summer. And, uh, you know, in the winter as well. And you know I've got a year fades on this 
competing in Indigo Invitational, and it's just incredible. Absolutely incredible. You know, stay with me, stay with me, and I will show you my collection of 25 ounce denim. You might be shocked how many pairs I have. So I'll show you my collection at the end. You know, when we talk about availability, you know, it's fine to say, okay, who is the best? But if you can't buy them, you know, it doesn't mean a whole lot. So with Iron Hearts, these jeans are their standard production jeans. So it's continuous production, but they sell out so fast. But because it's a continuous production, you know, it is fairly easy to get them. Being easy, maybe it's not a good description, but they are available on continuous basis. Now these are special edition. Now Samurai, Samurai tends to produce the 25 ounce as only special editions. And these special editions, they come out maybe once a year. So the av availability on these is really limited. It's a short period of time. They sell out really, really quick and it's difficult to get them. So we talked about uh, availability. Let's talk about price. You know, um, Samurai, they go for 295 US dollars. And uh, Samurai, um, Iron Hearts, they sell for 475 US dollars. So huge price difference. And in terms of features, they have the same features. So we've got um, um, Salvage ID, Salvage ID, we've got hidden hidden rivets, you can see hidden rivets. We've got lined back pockets. We've got salvage ID on iron hearts. Now versus Samurais, let's look at the features that Samurais offer. Again, we've got no salvage ID. So one feature less on these ones, uh, special uh, addition pocket bags. So, whereas um, the iron hearts were just plain white, we've got a beautiful design here. They've got hidden rivets. They've got unlined pockets. They've got salvage ID. So, in terms of price versus um, versus features, you can see that iron heart does offer a couple more features, does offer uh, tucked in belt loops, as you can see right here. The, the salvage ID on the fly is both sides. And um, the patch, you can see so thick, it's incredible. So although the price is uh, quite a bit more, they do offer more features. Whereas um, uh, Samurai is a little more affordable, at least when you buy them from uh, different stores, um, but they do have few less features. So we come to that big question, who is the best? You know, in terms of fading, we saw Indigo Invitational year one, Samurai take first place, Indigo Invitational Year 2, we saw Iron Heart take first place. So they are monsters for fades, and you can see both of them produce award-winning fades. In terms of feature, features, we can see that Iron Heart is offering more features, but the price is, in, is significantly higher. In terms of denim quality, they are very different in the weave, how they react and wear, and the type of face they produce. So at the end of the day, I would say that Samurai offers better value, but they are much more difficult to get and much more rare. 
where his iron heart offers the highest level construction, the highest level of features. The denim is tight weave denim, which will create higher contrasting fades. They are more expensive. They are continuous production, so it will be a little bit more uh, easy to purchase them. So um, I hope this helps you. And I said that I will show you my entire collection of 25 ounce denim jeans. And here it is. <laughs> it's shocking. Let's go through it, okay. Iron Heart, 25 ounce, triple seven. Iron Heart, 25 ounce, triple eight. And we've got a black inside. Iron Heart, 634, 25 ounce. We've got Samurai's 25 ounce. This is 710 cut, special edition. We've got Iron Heart 25 ounce. This is S3000 cut, special edition. We've got Samurai's 25 ounce. This is 511 cut, uber, uber cool with this beautiful arcs. Super rare, super cool, super special. I'm keeping it for a special occasion. And now in my hand, I'm holding Strike Gold Monster. This is extra hard, 24.8 ounce unwashed denim that will become, I'd say 27 ounce once it's washed. They are hard, they're extreme, they are crazy, and we're gonna talk about it one day and compare them. So friends, smash that like button. Let's take this to the moon, and I wanna thank you. Check out some of the links, and join us the next time. They were instrumental in bringing to market and popularizing Blah, 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 blah. <laughs>